We gotta make it work. We can't open it. <laughs> it's like those toys I get from my kids. I'm Daniel Berman. I go to Red Rocks Community College and I'm 39 years old. Let's make a motor. I served about a year and a half in the Marine Corps. After getting out of the Marine Corps, I was just waiting tables at a restaurant down in Denver, just being a snowboard mom. As time moved on, I met my wife, decided to get a real estate license. I excelled. I've actually uh, hold records for the most sales, the most money made in a month. Uh, but I was just never fulfilled. Well, why are correctly? There was no personal satisfaction, no wow feeling. Life's too short not to enjoy it. A friend of mine had actually been in the solar industry and uh, got into that after taking about two preparatory classes. Decided to go actually for their associate's degree they offer. Well, my kid is going to love this. What I want to do is make leads like we have here, and so we're just adding on leads to this box. The degree that I chose to go with was an associate's degree in applied science for photovoltaics, which is basically it's changing photons, which are the sun's rays, into voltage, which is a usable form of energy. That goes in there. That is a positive lead. Okay, gotcha. Some of the classes there, they're hands-on. A lot of the electrical classes are really what intrigued me. If you're going to teach someone a technical type of skill, I think that you need hands-on training. So actually, if you go around the facility here, you go around the campus, you can see a lot of the annexes, the labs, and all of that. It made possible by ATE and National Science Foundation. So what is ATE? Well, ATE is uh, Advanced Technology Education, and it's funded by the National Science Foundation. And they authorize funds to be utilized for many advanced technology programs. And for Red Rocks, it was uh, approved for green jobs education. So we developed programs around this to actually create classes and courses in many areas, which directly went to green jobs training as we have with Daniel here. Since I've been at Red Rocks, I've seen what these grants and what you know, this has been able to do for the school. This tracks, it's at perfect SDC all day long. Certain buildings are actually completely run by the solar power that they're producing, and the students built these arrays are in their labs and their classes. This also feeds the building next door, so these two buildings are connected. And, you know, it's been able to enhance, I think, the experience for any student, including myself, where you can go to a place and you can see different forms of this type of renewable energy, and you're able to actually go and play with it and learn about it, touch it, feel it. Daniel had the background, he had the knowledge, so yes, he was a first year apprentice on the books, but with the education that you guys gave him in the background, he was so much more ahead of the game than, than the others. Since I've been with uh, Stellar Energy Contractors, I've been able to use pretty much everything I've learned at Red Rocks. We started as a small mom and pop shop. From there, we decided, you know what? We're also a roofing company. Let's try to air, air sealing, insulation. These are classes that I've actually taken at Red Rocks. So we decided to put our feet into it. We ended up adding energy audits and air sealing, uh, you know, the, the weatherization steps that he's been taught. It seems that every part of the building envelope that we touch, uh, Daniel has got experience in. I've installed uh, well over 200 solar systems for individuals. Everything from grid tie to off-grid to hybrid systems. Using all the education that I've actually gained at Red Rocks Community College, I was able to completely air seal and insulate my house and I built a 4.6 kilowatt uh, solar system on my house and completely wired it and installed it myself. This house is actually what we consider a net zero house. This house is actually producing more power than it utilizes. This system has saved 19,582 pounds of carbon that hasn't been put into the air. My kids are my life, you know, along with my wife. Look, it's really good luck. I have two little boys, the two best things I've ever made in my life and ever will. To come home every day and know that you're doing good and you know, have your child interested in what you do because you can actually explain to them and show them is just a wonderful feeling. You know what you do? Maybe we'll have a fire? Oh, you like would you like to cook marshmallows? Yeah. You're doing something, in my opinion, that's truly beneficial for people. What's important to me is that Daniel's happy. He used to be in sales, and um, you know I didn't see that happiness in him until he he started working in solar. And I'm just so proud of him, and I'm, I'm happy that he's happy. That's what's important to us. I love going to work. It's just an amazing feeling, and, you know. To be 39, to be able to, you know, proudly say I'm happy at what I do, as opposed to a lot of people, they work in these jobs and they're miserable, and they look at everything as a paycheck. I look at this as a career. This is where I want to be. This is what truly makes me happy. 
an impressive feeling. I'm definitely grateful to ATE and National Science Foundation for allowing people like myself to be able to change a career and at my age and my stage of life being able to give me the tools that I'm going to need to become a success.